Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Microsoft is expected to announce their new cloud PC platform at their Microsoft Inspire event this week, which is taking place on the 14th and 15th of July 2021. So that's this week, and we are already on the 13th of July today. So that's in the next day or so that we are expecting that announcement from Microsoft regarding their cloud PC. Now, I have posted two videos previously on Microsoft's cloud PC, and I will leave uh, links to those videos down below in the description box if you are interested. Now, at the beginning of July, uh, I um, reported in a video I posted that there was a screenshot that had been leaked um, online. It wasn't really a screenshot. It was more a graphic image of what, um, you know, an image of what the uh, a cloud PC would look like, just to give us an idea, um, more or less, what we could expect in the eventual rollout of that Microsoft Cloud PC. And another image now has made its way online, and it's a promotional image. And just like the first one, it's not really a screenshot, but more a graphic of what it could look like. And this is very blurry. Um, I apologize for that, because this has been blown up from a smaller image. And in it, we can see that, as I mentioned in previous videos, it's going to run in your browser. And, you know, yeah, we can see the start menu on the bottom left, the search field, your taskbar icons, your system tray in the bottom right. And this just gives us an idea of what the cloud PC more or less will look like when it eventually rolls out. And at this stage, we know that it is codenamed Deschutes, and it will basically provide an Azure-powered Windows 10 or 11 desktop, mainly to enterprises and companies. At this stage, it doesn't look like it's going to roll out to uh, consumers, uh, you know, your general public, but more focused at enterprises and companies. And, it, you know, obviously, because it's in the cloud, it will give you a lot of security. You can access it anywhere and you don't have to upgrade your hardware. So you could basically use a much older hardware. All you would need is basically just to get online. And then when you're in your cloud PC, um, basically, the you know, it's all powered by the servers that are providing the service of the cloud PC in the cloud. So you wouldn't have to have any you know, hardcore hardware or a high powered machine to actually run the cloud PC. That would all be taken care of by the servers of Microsoft. Now, you can basically choose a number of instances as I reported in my uh, previous video. So you'll have a lot of safe states and configurations. So you could, you know, basically when you log back in, you could um, have a safe state. You wouldn't have to restart the whole machine. You would just log in again and it would have a lot of uh, configurations that you could access, which I think would just make things a lot more user friendly. So I just wanted to let you know, I um, mean, the next day or two, Microsoft sh uh, could be announcing their new cloud PC that will be an Azure based uh, powered cloud experience. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.